Welcome to the Air Lounge. This room was inspired by a Ritz-Carlton camp in Palm Beach, Florida, where I used to bring my kids. We have a DJ booth upstairs, a little room for the kids to hang out. We have a half pipe for the children. We have a rock climbing wall here. This room is every kid's dream, like a summer camp indoors, all in one little space. We are now in the lower level, and down here we have your game room. We've got several different conversation areas. So why don't you come with me this direction, and I wanna show you what I love most about this bar. You know, one of the things that the builder did with this home is because it's a showcase home, they've got some really cool things in here. We've got this quartzite counter, and at the same time, we've got a glass countertop that is suspended by this cable. It's so cool, it's so neat. And when you come around here to the back end of the bar, they've got this really cool art piece display for the floor where you have this glass covered space with the upside down half wine bottles. You're surrounded by the beautiful art of the wine bottles and it's just a great space to be. So this home starts with water and ends with water. And one of the cool things that the builder did is created an interior architecture to match that feeling and that design. So the ceiling is actually cut to look like a constant flow of water from one end of the house to the other. Aside from the water aesthetic, there's actually a functional purpose. The water behind me actually cools the air as it comes down. When this door is open, it flows throughout the house, goes upstairs, and there's vents where the air flows outward, thereby it cools the entire house. There's, a, there's an airflow process. It's a really cool design. On this level, we have three separate entertainment areas. So in this first space, this is kind of cool because it's retro. And Vegas, Retro Vegas is, is always interesting and fun. We have a sunken conversation area. The other two are a little bit more in the norm of, of eclectic traditional with a slight edge of contemporary. And this leads us to the point where I really wanna show you. And this is what you don't see or I haven't seen in very many houses, if any, in Las Vegas. What you're looking at is the bottom of a nine and a half foot pool. Because it's a zero edge pool, which means that it overflows on every side, all you see is water. And when this home first came out and was on display for everyone to come take a look at, they had mermaids in the pool. You get to sit down here, watch your friends jump in the pool. Hopefully they're clothed. I saved the best for last. We're outdoors on the 16,000 square foot lot. The architecture of this home is just as impressive from the rear as the front. You can see the board form concrete, the louvered awning, and the suspended plunge pool from the master creates shade for the outdoor terrace. And I'm not floating on water. We're actually on the private island where you can lounge or even place a DJ for a party. In the distance, what you're seeing is the new downtown Miami skyline. Traditionally, there was one skyline, which was the famous Miami skyline you might have seen in the 90s or Miami Vice. But because of all the new development, you actually have a second skyline, which I think is turning out to be even more beautiful than the original. While this home was built, keeping in mind that a family may live here, that's why the bedrooms are so generous. Really, it's a party house. If you live here, you're going to host, you're going to entertain. People are going to want to come over to your house for barbecues to see the sunsets. This is a house made for hosting. We're down on the third level. The third level is when it's 2.30 in the morning and the cops come knocking on the door and want to shut down the party. You come down here. This is the ultimate adult playground. We have everything for you. 12 foot fireplace, 12 foot ceilings. And remember, we're underground now and we have 12 foot ceilings. We have the full bar, fully stacked, gold bar, whiskey. You could pick your poison. You have your glass foosball table just for the occasional foosball match. Billiards, gentlemen's table. You gotta have a glass billiards table. Touch of a butt and the doors fully automated, open up and pocket into the walls. Here we are in our movie theater. The walls of the theater are lined with Egyptian silk. The custom-made ceiling is on a spring system, both of which combine to give the best possible acoustics and sound while enjoying your 14-foot screen. One of the more unique features of this home theater is while you're enjoying your movie with the doors closed, if someone enters the outer door, it blinks the lights on to alert you of their presence. So no house is complete without a game room. You grab your drinks at the bar, shoot a little bit of pool, you can watch six games on six TVs, or you can have all of them displaying the same movie or whatnot. And one of my favorite features of this house is hidden behind this wall is a secret room 
which you can turn into a full panic room as there's plumbing to add a bathroom or a kitchen. So when the zombies come, you have somewhere to go. Or just lock up your valuables. Right outside the spa, step down for some sunbathing onto the yard and pool. Here you have your Zero Edge Infinity Pool, 250 feet. This fantastic pool was actually designed around a very sacred specimen. It is a jacaranda tree. This tree is so special, already made the pool float all the way around the tree. Coupled with the fire pit and a nine by 12 LED screen that pops out from the ground. So you can watch your movie while taking a dip in your hot tub or while you're taking a swim. This is the life. This rooftop deck is equipped with the first ever residential Tesla solar panels. You have very low electric bills and you also have built-in gardens. Olive trees and succulents adorning your entire outdoor experience. Automated sunshades, close them right up with the touch of the button. If you want that sun experience, you have your chaise lounges straight over here facing the view. And of course, another bar. Once you grab your cocktail, Come on over to your very own first row view. In this fantastic swing, this is paradise. Welcome to our recreation room, which is located right off of our sandy beach pool area. What you're looking at here is the seawall that is attached to our major pools, and it's about 10, 11 feet deep. We have an outdoor seawall and an indoor seawall. The kids will love it. So now we're at the tennis house, an amazing piece of the property. Two stories, overlooks the gorgeous pond, and most importantly, it was built in. They even thought to have a grass roof so it doesn't feel like a substantial building and it fits in with the landscape. Let's go take a look inside. So now we're inside the tennis house. There's a great living room and kitchen to be able to sit and entertain your guests and also to watch a game that's going on either day or night. You have sleeping for four, two bathrooms, two viewing areas, and you can watch tennis all day or even into the evening. And this is the ultimate outside living area. So you can actually have alone 55 people alone on the outside sliding deck. The best part of it, when we drive it, we actually fold the side glasses down and the entire deck slides right into the hall. So the extendable deck gives you another 12 feet and 455 square feet of living space. Here's one of the four piling systems which are responsible that the entire yard can be lifted above water so we are stable like a house. Here we are in the back of the boat. This is a lifting platform which can go down to the water in case you want to go for a swim or being picked up by a tender boat. And right if you get off the jet ski, very convenient, an outdoor shower. So I said this house is for entertaining. What's better than a 2,000 square foot nightclub? You've got your own DJ booth. You've got six different vignettes for seating. We've got an elaborate lighting system, lasers, black lights, disco balls. There's even doors to lead out to the pool, but they're outfitted with blackout shades to keep the environment here dark so you truly feel like you're in a nightclub. It's even got a 2,000 foot marble dance floor. Bottle service here starts at $55 million. Welcome to the most enormous terrace I've ever seen in Manhattan. You have 25 feet ceilings in this amazing protected loggia, wrapped around by the limestone facade of this beautiful building. This is the most unique place in the apartment. The length of this terrace is absolutely immense. The owner actually put two duplexes together and created this really unique view going through the terrace. We've actually had some amazing parties here. Over 150 people, ballroom dancers, all twirling around very comfortably. I know that any nightclub would kill for a space like this, but this is your own private residence. Just to give you an idea of how large this space is, the owners hid a yard here with a dog house and a jacuzzi. There's a dining room table, there's another lounge in the back, there's two grill stations. I mean, the list goes on. 